Ladies and gentlemen, we have meat. We have breached. Today we sabotage. Okay, today we sabotage. We, we got some interesting things going on here. Um, way more objectives <laughs> than, than the previous ones. Uh, we gotta recharge the dive suit. We gotta scan crates. I still gotta retrieve the chum uh, from the correct specimen crate. Which, to be fair, from our journals, we know that that's basically just a live human. Um, everything else has has failed to feed the deep correctly. Uh, and then we feed the deep, okay? Challenges, open some crates, um, complete in under 20 minutes. Let's just be realistic. <laughs> it's not happening, okay? Um, it's not happening, which means this is probably going to be a, a long run today. Can't believe this is legal. Results of the referendum were clear. This was the choice of the people. Surely the government can reverse it. Are you kidding? The government loves this. So true. Uh, governments love killing their citizens. <laughs> a little, maybe a little too on the nose? A minute and 15 in? Who knows? Okay, um, we're underwater. Immediately, which is terrifying. That's terrifying. Dive notes. Notice do not open up random sample crates. Many of them contain live and dangerous specimens ready to spring out at you like a jack-in-the-box. Okay, everything was labeled. Somehow this chaos mixes everything up. It's impossible to know what's inside without using the scanner. Okay. Ah, here's the scanner, and it costs one one resource in order to, to utilize it. Okay. Um very interesting beginning so uh, where's my shop <laughs> that's that's my first major question um and how do i get more oxygen because my ass has 89 percent oxygen currently are you perhaps going to take my resources yeah okay so my shop is here that is a plus at least uh it's a little scary still it's a little scary. Um, two more bars, fully recharge. Okay, okay. Yeah, we can make that work. Um, lights I think is going to be valuable. We, we can buy bombs. Ah, specimen keys. That's good too. Give me some lights. I think some charges are intelligent, but I'm gonna tell you, I'm gonna take a guideline right out the get-go, which may seem, this may seem peculiar. But I think it's going to be intelligent for us to basically try to bring this down as far as humanly possible. And I'm just going to stop it there. A little scary. There was, <laughs> there was a spider boy there. Advanced in vivo testing on the captured specimen is underway. It exhibits limited cognitive capabilities, appears to lack higher order intelligence, however able to navigate simple mazes. This morning, it turned off the lights in its tank by squirting jets of water at the bulbs and short-circuiting the power supply. Yeah, it seems like that's probably going to be uh, a problem. Just realistically speaking, some some problematic uh, activity from our, our boy. We're probably weighing ourselves down too much bringing the stuff back. Um, not to mention the fact that this is... A little bit out of the way of our base, I think. Or not. That's a pocket of air, man. Okay, hold on. Just kidding. That is not a pocket of air, but that is the shop. So this is not out of the way at all. Uh, this is actually brilliant. We are weighed down. Um, which there's concerns about. <laughs> I put the line down and then I didn't take the line. Which is a horrible... I'm, I'm the worst, to be honest. I'm just the worst. Okay. We can recharge. I, we don't need to yet, okay? Give me some more bars. Um, we can only kill Spider Boy with bombs, which is something that I have to keep in mind. I also think that a light down there has value, okay? I think it has value, but give me toe strength twice. The fact that there's so many upgrades on toe strength tells me everything that I need to know. Uh, and that is that we are going to need some resources, man. So the more that I can collect and get going now... Is there something here? 
No, it's just, uh, I think that's a, a silt machine. Not a slit machine, like I've said in previous episodes. That's my bad. Uh, hey, what's up with your peculiar lights that... Oh, don't do that, brother. Okay. That is a turret. And that is a hole that I am interested in going into. Uh, and I think that we would be... Uh, I'm playing with fire. <laughs> Okay, we're good. Um, that's a hole that we should go into to see what's going on. Especially, I mean, even if there's just resources in it. In the early game here, I would love to... I would love to see it. So, bring me back up. I think at this point... I mean, at this point, I'm gonna tell you. Give me the tow line. I know that that seems insane. Um... I'm also going to refill my oxygen here. And then we're gonna bring this tow line and we're gonna start you going this way. I just want to, to build us a way down to this hole, okay? And I think, I think this is good. So nothing too peculiar in here. There are multiple enemies, um, which raises some questions. I'm gonna shoot you. There, there is. That's one of the the crates. Okay. Oh, brother, we we found the mother load. Uh, do not, do not open them. Oh my God, man, I got so lucky. <laughs> Uh, yeah, okay. We took a random guess and got it. <laughs> okay, okay. Um, now, they did also say that one of the optional challenges is retrieve five crates, right? Or open five crates. So I think what I would like to do, I'd like to drop these bombs for right now. Uh, now going up this way is probably a mistake. This is this is a maze for sure. <laughs> it's it's got like this route is way sketchier because uh, we have multiple of these guys. We also know that there's a spider over here. I mean, and he's he's probably going to just jump right back into the zone that I'm at. We get back, and then we're going to bring a couple crates back. Because at this point, I mean, I'm going to go for, for alternate objectives if I can. We we have the ability to... Like, this, this is an amazing start. We, we already have the chum. It was pure guess work. I, we're going to lose one, one thing. It's fine, okay? We, we don't worry about it. But this... The value that we have here... Oh my lordy, is it good. Okay. So, get me in. Oxygen's looking fine. How many is it to scan? It's just one to scan. So you got tons of juice. Give me... Give me a toe strength. I'm gonna bring back five crates. Okay. And, uh... Hopefully we can open well I'm gonna bring back I'm gonna bring back as many of them as I can hold actually I I have no interest in only bringing back uh five I might as oh my god okay little little spicy right there a little spicy okay so bring back as many of these as you can muster now there are keys but you have to be a little careful with the keys, man, because they'll just automatically open it. I'm going to have to organize. I'm sure there's going to be some way for me to tell, like, which ones from the scanner, which ones I should open and which ones I shouldn't. I uh, Might as well grab some of this, too. We got quite the haul coming back. <laughs> My guy is going to be weighed down by this, but it's also his job, so I don't really care. I don't really care. Ooh, a little, little spicy. Do not jump this way. Do not jump this way. Okay. I feel like we have taken 
a slew of risks uh, in in this run so far, <laughs> but I, I I think that that's fine, honestly. I'm really curious to see uh, effectively what all of these game modes are because they they've kind of made a different game in each expedition, and since they're randomly generated, I mean it's very easy to replay these. But I do wonder if there's going to be, like, one at the very end that is, like, a purely randomized one. Or, or something like that, right? So that you always have, like, an infinite replayability system. I think it'd be really cool. So, Scania. Zero chum, two creatures, three empty, and two other. Okay. Um, I got so lucky. <laughs> I should have probably... You know what, bro? What What's our time right now? We don't know. Um, what if we just send it? Th this is uh, the rare opportunity where I got so lucky that we might as well try to get the under 20 achievement, right? Like, we, we got maybe nine minutes to do this. I'm just gonna hide real quick. Oh, oh Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay yeah okay thank you <laughs> thank you appreciate that that made me feel really nice inside okay okay holy crap man get me the frick out of here don't do that again to me i will scream like a little baby okay so we have the chum uh, realistically speaking, I, I think you just go down, because it's always further down. So let's experiment. We have no oxygen. Let's probably get some oxygen first. So open you, oxygen, maybe give me an extra light here, and then, and then send it, okay? Under 20. Let's, let's do it. Let's do it. We have, we have gotten extraordinarily lucky and i would like for my luck to continue this is a dead end okay should i be collecting resources like yeah definitely but you know what sometimes you gotta sometimes you gotta just go okay tons of chests and stuff if i cared this would be amazing there's honestly like a million of these crates down here. So there's there's value in in a lot of this. This is oh my god, what is that? Uh, I'm playing with a lot of fire here. <laughs> okay. Not much kicking in here. There was it was a chest. If there's an enemy in here, I mean we're like super dead. Let's let's destroy you. You only have one more thingy. Month of trying to communicate with the deep. We're no closer to cracking the code. That is, if there's anything to decipher. Okay. Screeching sound right before it's fed feels strangely familiar. I wonder what would happen if you played it in reverse. Ah, uh, bro. There's gonna be... There's gonna be, like, weird ARG stuff in this game that I am... I'm not fit for. I just need to find the deep, Okay. Th this whole side is is a wash. We, we need to just go. Okay, there's so many chests. And so much loot. Like, I, I really should be carrying some of this. But the reality is, I'm... It's, it's right there, man. It's right there. This has to be it. This has to be it. Put me in. If this isn't where the monster is, I'll be shocked. No, you will not. He's right here. Oh my god. I'm so good. <laughs> okay. Um. Well, that's what an under 20 minute run looks like. Here I was thinking uh, we were going to have a, a struggle today. Ain't no struggle. Um, that's, that's just clean. That's just clean. Only those who will risk going too far can possibly find out how far one can go. So true. Uh, I was about to say Morbius, uh, Mobius, not not Morbius. Morbius is the is Morbentime guy. Wow. Okay. I'm like, whew, 
I, I, I got like a, a thrill going through me. That felt great. Um, did not open five crates. But you know what? I think that when you open one crate and you get the chum, you, you take that and you run. I'm gonna go back in, okay? We're, we're gonna do another run of the same one. Because, uh, I think there's... There's value in playing again. And doing it kind of the correct way this time. Not that, not that that wasn't correct. But I mean, it wasn't. You should not just randomly open the crates. Because that seems like a, <laughs> seems like a horrible way to do things. Um... I think it worked out fine. I think it worked out completely fine. And recharging the dive suit is the easiest objective of all time, man. Like, that's that's so simplistic, it's insane. So, it's a good start. It's a very, very good start. Basically, if I die now, I don't care, right? Because I've, I've already succeeded today. It's a beautiful feeling, to be honest with you. Because we, we've had some, uh, we've, we've had some rough first runs, uh, in, in this game. And I'm, I'm happy to have a, an extremely successful first run here. Now, drop off this stuff. We're gonna drop off the crate. I'm not going to scan it yet, though. Like, I, I would like to remove you. I think ideally you scan, like maybe three crates at a time. And that's that's kind of the, the start that you do. You do have another two over here. I mean, dude, we just got, I can't stress enough how freaking lucky we were. <laughs> it's, it's unreal how lucky we were. And I think that that's frankly hilarious. I think that it is so funny. And there are going to be so many people. I have a feeling that it's it's not easy to get the chum in 20 minutes. Okay. And find the guy in 20. Like this is tricky. It's tricky. You you got to you got to get less jammed, please. Thank you. Battery life decreasing, but do not worry. Um we we got tons of time to make this work. So let's drop these in. Let's press you. Three crates, one creature. Okay, um, let's remove... Let's remove that. I'm gonna scan you again. Okay, so there's a creature in those. That means that this one that fell is an other. Which my guess is this is probably, like, resources, right? Some kind of, uh, special resource. So, let's put you there. Is five to open it? That's absurd. I cannot afford that right now. So simply just don't afford it is what I'm going to say. We'll leave it right there. If I can get keys, we'll, we'll get keys. Okay. And then that'll be fine. But for now, I'm going to tow line down into this general area. I think that there's, there's a, a good path here there might have been a better path over the the top area but i think this is fine give me give me some resources i want yellows more than anything right now i like purples are good they they are our heartbeat essentially at this point wow this is very wide open the random generation adds so much to the game, man. It really does. Okay, so there's a crate. Can bring that up. And then you got a, a sniper down there. Ooh, good, good gem right there. And uh, one more purple. I think that you probably try to make your way back up now. You do have quite a lot of resources <laughs> attached to you. And you're playing with a little bit of fire. Yeah, okay. It's fine. We we will be okay. There's our tow line. Okay, so tow line continue left is our or guideline, whatever. It's a tow line, brother. Um 
Our guide line continued to the left is a hole to go into. I think you want to go into that immediately because there's a chance that that's going to be um, the crates, right? And that would be valuable for us to, to have. Let's put you in. I'm going to take you out. Okay. We're, if we get... So, it, the, before it was one creature, one other. Now, it's one creature, one empty. So, one of those in there is still a creature. That means that both of these are openable. And we're just going to keep this going like this, okay? Until we are positive that we, we do not need more. So, give me this. Let's fully recharge. And then I'm going to go into the the hole down here. And we're going to pray that it's the same crate hole that we had last time. Because frankly, we, we come out of that with a lot of resources if it is. Uh, there's a chance it's not. And it could be a, a completely other randomly generated one. Um, some resources right off the get-go. Uh, looking for crates. You got a spider there. You got a guy here. I mean, you you really can't afford to fight the spider right now. There's also like six snipers on the bottom, so that's that's fun. I think you bring this back, and we'll just continue to we'll continue to to test our boundaries a little on on these crates removing every once in a while trying to to figure out which is a creature and which is not and and i will tell you i'm not against opening ones with creatures in it i think that we can do it in an elegant way <laughs> where we like drop a key from way up above that spawns the creature it'll be pissed at me but i just line up my gun and i shoot it maybe stupid okay there's definitely a chance that it is a, a stupid idea and we should be able to, our tow line should be right up here. This, this is probably too much for me to carry. <laughs> but our tow line's right up above. I'm, I'm gonna try to just tank this one out. I think that adding another to it is stupid. Uh, but, you know, Mama always said stupid is as stupid does. I'll add another. Why not? I mean, we're so much faster when we're on this. This is why you increase your toe speed, ladies and gentlemen. And why you put in the guidelines. I, I stand by. The guidelines are... They're the key to success. I know we lost one. It's okay. Okay. Um, Drop you. I'm going to tell you, at this point, give me one key. Give me a red key. I'm going to drop this crate in. So we know we have one creature, one empty in there. Which we both don't want to open. So this is actually the ideal scenario. So now you just press it. So one creature, one empty. Now you have two creatures, one empty. So you just keep on documenting it as such, okay? This is, this is so easy. Okay, brilliant. There's one opened. And then I'm going to drop this from above, but okay, beautiful. It's just more resources. That's exactly what we expected. Those all come in. Oh, baby is good. It is so good. So now we can do things like buy another guideline, probably buy a bomb, and we can bring both of those back into the hole we were just in. Um, and in turn, we... we benefit from uh we, we can try to bomb some of the the spiders that are down there can i afford i can't afford another one of these i think this is worth it to do this and we're, we're pretty sure we know that that's just resources okay so that's two crates opened um we need to open five to get the the challenge achievement I'm, I'm tempted. I know you guys are going to lie. You're, you're going to want to see the other levels for sure, which is completely understandable. But I, I'm itching to go back into the originals at this point. 
uh, in order to see what all else challenge wise that we can make happen right okay so that's huge great guideline and then this time we're going to try to take a more northern path because we know that the south has a spider and multiple shooters we'll, we'll snag some of these along the way we, we really we don't need purples purples are we got a million of them and this is a mother load of crates. Okay, beautiful. So let's find a good place to bomb. And like over here. Oh, okay, a minigame. Oh, no, it's a crate scanner. Is that another shop too? Okay, hold on. <laughs> Hold on, because I can just live here now? Like, we, we have just found ourselves a, a new area. Uh, this is massive. I'm just gonna stay here now. Okay, okay. Unexpected. Unexpected, but, but really quite lovely. Because um, we know we have three crates over here. One, two, three, and like with all of the resources around, I, I can just plop them into our shop system. I feel like that this shop should not be able to read my other shop. <laughs> like that, that seems so overpowered to me, uh, but I'm, I'm not going to complain about it. It's very nice to have. Um, I'm really slowing myself down to the point where this is unnecessary and stupid. Uh, I feel like this is gonna be like the one thing that makes you all the most mad while I play this is the fact that I could easily just like drop a couple things off and move faster and instead I choose to just remain uh, burdened by what has been. Okay, so beautiful, four crates ready to scan, let's scan. One chum, two creature, one other, okay. I remove one at a time. Okay, I remove one at a time. Obviously, finding the chum is huge. Okay, that one was a creature. Brilliant. Let's remove this one. So we do not want to open any of those. Okay, both of those are the creatures. I mean, that's... You couldn't ask for a better scenario here. Oh, frick me. That's not what I wanted to have happen. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, not not good. <laughs> not good. Did not want to release a, a creature into the world. I figured the key was going to spawn somewhere else, but that's that's on me. I'll, I'll eat that one. Take it right on the chin. How about we remove this crate uh, from the premises? Holy crap, man. Give me a, a minor heart attack. This game's going to test my blood pressure. Um get my heart rate up it was good little exercise during the the day been playing a lot of pickleball recently that's correct i am one of those people um it's good to get your your blood pressure up a little uh, blood heart rate getting your blood pressure up that that implies that i'm uh dying of a cholesterol based disease i'm not my my blood pressure is very healthy it's uh four over six if you I don't know, reduce the fraction. Isn't it like 120 over 80 is the good 120 over 60? Eh, somebody that's in the medical industry is going to be like, you're freaking dying. Go see a doctor. I regularly go to the dentist. And they check my blood pressure. Do, do, do all, all dentists do blood pressure checks? Or is this just a, just a my dentist kind of thing? You'll never know, to be honest with you. Okay, um, we are going to buy a plethora of keys, because I'm opening both of these. Uh, at this point, too, I mean, I've, I've once again completed the challenges. So, give me both of these. We're going to open both of these. Okay, five crates have been opened. Our chum exists. It's that we have such an alarming number of, of purples at this point. 
Give me a guideline. Give me a refresh. Give me a, a toe. And then, uh... Let's just kick it, to be honest. Part of me wants to just GTFO, man. I, I don't think there's any reason for me to stay here at this point. You going down or are you coming back up? Man, you're just gonna like chill here, huh? Yeah, yeah, you got me. I mean, I was kind of prepared for it. <laughs> <laughs> it might have given you a jump scare, but it didn't really scare me. I, I, I understood. <laughs> I, I knew what we were doing. Now, that one could have done- ah, Yeah, okay, that one got me. That one got me. Hey, can we, like, can we chill game with the, the making me jump out of my seat repeatedly? I didn't sign on for a horror game when uh, the title of the game is Feed the Deep Lovecraftian Horror Roguelike. Okay, um, first of all, recharge my health, and then, I mean, frankly, I got no clue what to do next. I guess it's just go find the, the thing, right? So let's, oh, this, this could be problematic. It was not problematic, narrator chimes in. We could buy a bomb and then blow that up. This is actually a complete dead end over here. I'm now realizing that. Let, let's... Let's buy three bombs. <laughs> might, might be unnecessary. But I kind of want to... Drop one right there. Nuke them. Beautiful. And open the path even better, to be honest. It's actually amazing for us. Oh, and I have a feeling that that may be the entrance that we need. And we're at least going to try it, right? I'm just going to end up carrying this chum around with me repeatedly forever. Um, but that's, that's okay. That's okay. We, we love that for me. Okay, it's a six. Um... Look, we're gonna go deep and try to win this. So take what you need to win, is my opinion. Um, toe line is irrelevant, so give me light. I got two bombs, extra light, the chum, and presumably the entrance that I need to survive, and we're at full oxygen. What could go wrong? I think we got everything we need and then some. Put me in. Uh, there's a chance this is not the correct place, because there's still... A lot of room to go down, I'll tell you. Uh, but I will tell you, this looks pretty good. Okay. Beautiful. Nuke his ass. Great work. Actually, just some stellar work. Except for the fact there's another friggin' one. Okay. why you brought the bombs man <laughs> this, this, is, this is why we're here makes it very easy okay tons of item crates okay you know what you're you're gonna play my hand on this one i can take my time i i am more than happy to take my sweet old time i'll bring all this back i'll collect some items i'll uh i'll make it happen now i do think that i may leave the chum in here although that seems like a terrible idea i don't know if people can come claim it or something while i'm not here so let's let's just take the long road back okay we're we're doing completely fine and we're coming back with with a ton of resources so i can open both of these crates i can get myself an item uh we can accomplish everything that we wish to accomplish it's just a small setback. It's not even a setback. It's me choosing that, hey, maybe I don't want to die. Okay. It's playing intelligently. Hey, another book. We were all singing happy birthday when the windows suddenly exploded. Friends, gone in an instant. Devastation. Beyond comprehension. We, we saw this one at some point. 
So that's okay. Well, we continue to find more of them. I, I'm sure that there's going to be secrets to find, okay? I mean, it, it feels pretty obvious so far that they're, they're hinting at some secret things in this game. Um, what those secret things are, I mean, that, that part I got no clue. We'll, we'll figure that out as time goes on. I'm just here. I'm a happy little explorer. I do my expeditions. I get in, I get out. I complete some challenges when I can, and we, we live a happy life. Okay, two keys, please. Should give me both of these. Let's just drop you on top of it. Un. Pretty good. Um, Believe it or not, I'm just going to take the gold pack on this one. And then you... I, I, somehow, you're... <laughs> okay, drop it. That's a massive amount of money, man. Holy crap, okay. So, open the shop. We're going to increase our muscle. Give me two of these. Um, give me a, a guideline. Because at this point, I might as well guideline down. So, start ya. This is bringing you down this way, around. Oh, what are you doing here, my guy? <laughs> you're, you're not who I wanted to see, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to try to slip back in over here. We do have some resources. I mean, is it worth bringing them back up? It probably is, but you know what? Let's Let's just drop them in this room for right now. I'll drop that guy there. We we know that bottom is not correct here. So I go right. Okay. When times get rough, you go right. It's always going to be the furthest possible down. It's right here. Okay. Yeah, you know what? Take your win. Take your win before you do something stupid. You completed some challenges. Um, we never found the minigame machine. In, in this level, so is definitely hiding somewhere. I never went to, like, the bottom left of the map. Uh, but all things considered, this was this was not bad. This was not bad. With every sacrifice, we defy the deep's tight grip on our destiny. Okay, that's good. That's good. Uh, two wins today. Who knew, to be honest? You're gonna see 37 minutes, you're gonna know that I went into a harder level, and you're gonna go, this, this guy died twice today. Nope. No chance. He win. He win. He win and he do it twice. We, well, we've got two more expeditions to go. Gotta complete five of them to unlock this, this sixth one. This one has teleportation and unpredictable hazards, which sounds real bad. Um, this one seems insane. Advanced creatures locate the plasma torch. <laughs> Should be fun. We'll do it in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, as always, like on the video. Much appreciate. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.